Learn all about the Koya 4-in-1 cot. Parts in the set. Base, the base extension, two side walls, two wall extensions, two end panels, two A legs, two B legs, low wall, two straps, four wheels, set of keys and a fixing screws. The set comes with a 90 by 60 cm mattress. Koya can serve as a co-sleeper cot, 90 by 60 cm independent cot, 120 by 60 cm cot, and playpen for older children. Let's start assembly by connecting leg A and B with the end panel. Place the end panel against the part of the leg that has only two holes. Connect the end panel with the legs using the long screws. Make sure that the ends of the legs with the holes for the wheels are on the wider side of the end panel. Do the same with the other end panel. Now, connect one side with the end panels. The wider horizontal strip should be at the bottom and the holes on the inside. Use these screws to connect the side to the end panel. Do the same on the other side. Now it's time to assemble the base. The mounting hole should be on the bottom of it. Affix it to the legs on both end panels using four short screws. This is the substructure of the cot. If you want to assemble the co-sleeper cot, you have three base heights to choose from. Connect the low side with the end panels of the cot on both sides, using four long screws to do this. Important! The bottom edge of the low side and the base of the cot must touch closely. Screw the wheels to the coir. Adjust the height of the base and low wall so that after sliding coir to the bed, the top strip of the wall is at least 2 cm under the top edge of the parent's mattress. Coir is suitable for beds with the following dimensions. Now that the cot is adjusted to your bed, secure it using two straps. Depending on the type of bed you have, weave the straps around the mattress or bed frame and connect to coir, threading them through the perimeter clearances between the rungs on both sides. Then buckle them and pull them tight. Finally, put the mattress inside. When assembling Koya in the independent cot version, you have four base heights to choose from. In this version of the cot, mount the tall side wall, holes facing inwards. The wider strip should be at the bottom. Affix the wall to each end panel using two long screws. Put the mattress inside. To extend coir, remove the base and side walls, leaving the end panels connected to the legs. If you're starting assembly from the bigger independent cot, place the end panel against the leg where there are only two holes. Connect the end panel with the legs using the long screws. The end of the legs with the holes for the wheels should be on the wider side of the end panel. The next step is to extend the sides. Place the side and extension so that the holes are aligned. In each side of the three holes, insert a screw and on the other side, the connector and turn to connect them. 
Do the same to extend the other side of the cot. Next, extend the base. Place the base and base extension so that the holes are aligned. Use these elements for assembly. Place four connectors inside the holes and then thread four short screws and tighten them. When connecting the side with the end panels, make sure that the narrower strip is at the top. Use four long screws, two for each side, to connect the side to the end panels. Now add the base to what you've already assembled. Remember that all extensions should be on the same side and the mounting holes on the bottom of it. Affix the base to the legs using four short screws and to the side wall using two long screws. Now add the second side wall and connect it to the base using two long screws and to the end panels using four short screws. In this version of the cot, you have four base heights to choose from. Once your baby starts standing up, set the base on the lowest, fifth level and you'll get a playpen. Screw the wheels to the cot and playpen. After setting up the cot, always remember to lock it. A mattress with the given dimensions is suitable for this version of the cot and playpen. And that's all we wanted to tell you about Koya. Sweet dreams! Kindercraft. Easy with kids.